Well, it turns out your blood type could be a good predictor of how sick you can get if you contract coronavirus. That is the suggestion of a pair of new studies on COVID-19 patients. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez tells us what this all means. Let's start out with, do you even know your blood type? And even if you do, is there anything you can do about it? Not without a bone marrow transplant or some other serious health issue. So what can we learn from these COVID blood type studies? The studies come from the medical journal Blood Advances. The Danish study analyzed data from almost half a million people tested for the virus and found that people with blood type O had significantly reduced susceptibility to coronavirus infection. A separate Canadian study of 95 hospitalized COVID patients showed that those with blood type A or AB typically had a longer stay in the ICU and were more likely to need a ventilator and kidney dialysis than patients with type O or B. But what does this mean? This doesn't mean that if you're blood group O, you don't have a risk of severe outcome from COVID. Nor does it mean that if you're blood group A, you're doomed. The director of the lymphoma service at NYU's Perlmutter Cancer Center says that blood types had little effect on other important outcomes. So the level of inflammatory cytokines that patients had in their blood was not different based on ABO blood type. Mortality, once you were on the ventilator, was also not impacted by ABO blood type. Since you can't change your blood type, Dr. Diefenbach says the more important risk factors are underlying health issues, heart disease, diabetes, and obesity, among others. Bottom line, we all still need to wear a mask. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.